I was reading through my comments of a Superstar KO video I just recorded, and I saw some people saying I didn't run with Lamar Jackson enough. So you know what we're doing today? We are only running with Lamar Jackson. I'm gonna go into Superstar KO, we're gonna get Lamar Jackson, and I can only run with him. I can't run with anybody else, I can't pass. I can call passing plays to make it look like I'm passing, but I still have to run. And we're gonna see if we can win all four games and become undefeated champs. I already know this is gonna be so frustrating, so I feel like for the playbook, we have to go backyard heroes. I wanna say they're the only ones that have like design quarterback runs. Picking defense to start, we got a couple ultra rares. We're gonna go Earl Thomas to start things off. Picking defense again. We might not even get Lamar in this draft. So we got three common players, but then we have an ultra rare Nick Bosa. I'm not mad about that because we're gonna need a good defense in order to try and win this whole thing. Final round, we are picking offense. And we got Lamar Jackson. Now here's the thing. This is the rare version that has first one free. I want to say it's only the ultra rare version that gets escape artist as well. We're going to see if we can do this with the rare version. If we can't, I'm going to come back and try it with the ultra rare version. Game number one. He's got Patrick Mahomes, Le'Veon Bell, a legendary Ed Reed. We got to win this game and hopefully we get defense to pick up Ed Reed. He's got all common receivers, so we don't need to worry about that. Oh, we're gonna get there already nick bosa he's gonna come out empty backfield oh he's running slants i'm right there neither of my guys went for it we had two guys that should have intercepted that he's gonna go back to the run that is going nowhere let me keep user and thomas okay same plays earlier i'm right there he's gonna test us again Earl Thomas ain't missing that. Let's go, boys. That is big right there. Defense did their thing. We just got to worry about that Ed Reed, who is not moving for some reason. We got about nine yards to start. The key to this play right here is patience. We just got to wait for our blocks. Okay, I'm going to take this back up the middle. Look at the juke moves. We're already up to midfield. I'm going to switch things up. I'm going to go quarterback draw on this play. Okay. Why, why was he so slow? Quarterback draw is so glitchy. Sometimes you're like super fast. Other times you're really slow. Okay, everybody's downfield. We got plenty of space to run. Look at this. This guy doesn't know what to do. Let me put Keenan in motion as like an extra blocker. I'm gonna go left. We lost a few yards. Feeling a little bit of pressure right here. I'm gonna send everybody deep. Okay, he does not have a QB spy in the field. We're going to easily pick that up. Seven carries for 64 yards. I feel like fatigue isn't a thing in Superstar KO. Same thing as last time. I'm sending everybody deep. Oh, get through there. We're going to have the touchdown. Game number one in the books. I don't want to sound mean. That guy was a bit of a bot. I'm sure this is going to get more challenging. We'll take our first dub. All right. I want to pick defense so we can get his Ed Reed. Oh, we're going to get offense. Who do we want here? That's the question. So we got DeAndre Hopkins, AJ Green, TY. We even have Amari Cooper. Here's what I want to do. We need to pick somebody that is good at run blocking. I'm going to go DeAndre Hopkins. Number one, I want to say he's the best run blocking here. But number two, he has the double me superstar ability. So hopefully my opponents are worried about him going deep and that'll give us more room to run with Lamar Jackson. And before we do get into game number two, today's video does have a sponsor. So a quick word from them. Now guys, I wanna go ahead and talk about SeatGeek for a minute. Now they've been one of my longest lasting sponsors on this channel. And the reason for that is they are my go-to when it comes to getting tickets. Now this just isn't sporting tickets. It could be concerts, it could be comedy shows, pretty much anything that involves buying tickets. A few reasons why I love SeatGeek is number one, the app is extremely user friendly, it is extremely easy to use, and they're gonna help you out as well. So everything is in one spot. And then on top of that, they're going to color code the tickets, that way you know what's a good deal and what's a bad deal. You wanna look for green, those are the good deals. And if you're still a little bit unsure, SeatGeek will actually show you a real picture from where you're gonna be sitting. That way you know exactly what you're gonna get. And if you guys do end up scooping up some tickets, let me tell you, if you enter in promo code TDP at checkout, that will get you $20 off that first purchase. I will put a link down below in the description. Make sure you guys go ahead and download SeatGeek today. I wish I could flip the play. I'm not trying to run towards Von Miller or Mel Blunt. We're gonna have to take this left, okay. All right. Oh, we made a, oh, we stiff armed him. Let's go. Lamar Jackson, what a run. Action Jackson doing his thing. Okay, this worked last time. 
Yeah, he was too late coming over. We're gonna have another pretty big run. I can't believe how much this is working. Okay, we made him miss. Oh, we got some blocks. Give me another one. It only took three plays. That is the common Lamar Jackson, who I feel like isn't that good. Okay, I got the middle. Oh, that's a fumble. Pick it up. Not that it matters, but Nick Bosa has a touchdown. We just won that game in four plays. That was complete domination right there. We have leveled up to 19. What is the highest you can get in Superstar KO? I wish they gave you more for like winning this. So we're picking defense right here. We should be able to get Ed Reed and possibly Mel Blunt. And we got both of them. Sometimes it does glitch out and you end up like getting no free agent players. So the decision we got to make, Ed Reed or Mel Blunt? I think we got to go Mel Blunt because we already have Earl Thomas playing safety. We need a cornerback. We are on to the semifinals. Who are we playing? He's got Michael Vick, Ted Hendricks. I feel like his team's kind of mean mugging me. Look at Amari Cooper and then look at Jalen Ramsey. This is going to be a test, like a math test that I'm probably going to end up failing like I used to back in the day. How did I not think of this earlier? I'm going to sub in use check at running back. Because he's a way better blocker than Philip Lindsay. Last time this didn't work, but we're gonna need some good blocks. Okay, we got space. Ted Hendricks is way too slow. I thought we were gonna get to corner. We're gonna have to keep playing mind games. I'm just gonna keep audible in all these players. Okay, his user goes left. I'm taking off. And I think we got the first down. I'm like still nervous, but I can feel the championship within our grasp. Okay, I'm going quarterback power. Look at that little stutter. We got so lucky right there. That would have been the end of us right there. If we lose that fumble, I have a feeling it's over. For some reason, this guy's not using Hopkins deep. So I put him on a drag. There we go. We got him distracted. Now we're taking off. We probably could have kept going. We're going to be just short. We are struggling a little bit right now. This guy's been sending all out pressure. Here comes another blitz. Oh, he's okay. We made a miss. And we got the first down. We fumbled again but it went out of bounds. We got four plays to get two yards. I'm going right up the middle. That is gonna be, we got nothing on that play. I'm gonna keep going quarterback power. We cannot fumble. Oh, just wait for it. We got the touchdown. I don't know what defense this guy's in, but I feel like we should be able to pick this up. I'm going with the quarterback power again. Oh, we're not gonna get it. Demarcus Lawrence, good play. We got six, so we're in a good position. We gotta be able to stop Michael Vick. He does have Amari Cooper as well. Okay. Oh, go get him. Nick Bosa. This guy is just wrecking havoc out there. Let me keep sending pressure. Okay. We got him again. This time it's Van Der Ash. This guy only wants to roll out. Third and forever. And we just won off a of safety. I don't know how we're doing this right now, but we are doing it. Ugh, let me get some stretching in. So we are picking offense with this final round right here. Let's see if we can get anybody good. Oh, we got George Kittle. That's right. You already know this man is about to be paving the way for us with those pancakes. It is crazy how fast you find games when you're playing solo. So he's got Snoop Dogg, Marvin Harrison, Brian Erlacher. That is a very good squad, but this guy doesn't have a quarterback. I feel like not having a QB in Superstar KO is actually a pretty big deal. I'm running right behind George Kittle every single play. Okay, nobody picked that man up. Give me those ankles. Lamar, take off. That is a good start. It looks like he's using Erlacher. I put Hopkins on a slant. And we got Kittle going deep. Okay. Oh, he's going to play us. Dang it. I feel like this guy knows what we're doing. He's lined up on Kittle. There's no way he leaves him wide open. Okay, he's going to play the slant. And we got plenty of room to run. We're going to go out of bounds. We got to play it safe. I'm going right back to it until he can show me he can stop the QB power. Oh, just wait for it. Oh, keep going. Lamar dragged him to the one. Look at that football. We're like three inches from scoring this thing. Okay. Oh, we're going to fall in there. I got so worried for a second. Let me switch things up and see if we can kind of fool this guy. I said everybody left. Oh, he was ready for it. Yeah, we had nowhere to go. We are one stop away from winning this thing. I'm worried about Snoop Dogg. He's going to run it the first play. Oh, he got some good blocks. Okay, that is a good run for him. He does have Derek Carr at quarterback. I'm going to try and get pressure. He's going to run it again. He's getting some really good blocks. Third and five. Okay, I got Snoop Dogg underneath. He went right over my head. That was a good read. Got him to a third and nine. Okay, I got Snoop Dogg. That's where he's going. 
and he still caught it. But he is gonna be short. I'm gonna use our Vanderash. We cannot get beat deep, though this might be a run right here. No, he's gonna pass it. Okay, I got Snoop, and that is incomplete. I don't even know what happened. It looked like Snoop Dogg absolutely burnt Mount Blunt. I thought that's where he was gonna go. I don't know who he was going to right there. I think Derek Carr might have just sold. There it is, winner, undefeated champs. For everybody that said I didn't run with Lamar Jackson enough in the first video, well, there you have it. We only ran with them. That is gonna do it though. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Be sure to leave a like if you guys want more Superstar KO. Also, let me know in the comments if you guys you know have any other challenges you'd like to see me do. Make sure you guys do sub if you're new around here. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.